COSA's database feature provides a simple and efficient way to manage and process structured data. In this example, I'm creating a simple bot that takes notes and records important tasks for my daily life. To get things started, I give my database a table name and a description so the model has a better understanding of how to use its functions. Next, you create a field, give it a description, and set the data type. This is similar to database functions in traditional software development, but COSA makes it really easy with this table structure. Now we click save and we can start to chat with our bot. With Coase, you can interact with your bot through natural language to insert or to query data into the database. I have to prepare for my next marathon, so I'm going to have my bot take a note that I have to run 12 miles after work. The bot will automatically create a new record based on my input and store it into my database. Once I submit my data, I can see what's happening behind the scenes by taking a look at the running processes. This also gives me a view of the SQL statement used in order to add the data to the database. Now, bring your attention to this button. As long as I'm in the Coase workspace, I can take a look at all the different data that I have stored here before sending out my bot and publishing it. You can also reset your data to start fresh. Remember, with Coase, you can deploy your chatbot to many chat applications like Telegram or Discord. This means you can submit or query data to or from your database at any time and anywhere you want. And that's how you use databases with Coase. If you have any questions, check out our documentation or join the conversation on Telegram or Discord.